Alrighty, I have a really quick video for you guys today just to talk about some super cool information. Some of you may know it, I'm not quite sure, uh, but I know a lot of my audience maybe doesn't know this. And uh, yeah, we got an exact number for you guys now. We were able to locate um, a document that has some information on Canada's Wonderland. Um, and a really cool piece of information that we found is Wonderland can have five attractions between 246 feet and 410 feet. So we got an exact max height envelope for Canada's Wonderland at 410 feet. Um, and they're going to have five attractions. Uh, south of Major Mackenzie is how it's listed specifically. So if they hadn't sold the land, they may have been able to have more. Um, between 246 feet and 10 or 10, 410 feet. They currently have about two to three. Um, between that, they have uh, Leviathan and Windseeker. And we are not sure if Slingshot falls in that category because when it is launching into the air, it does technically go into this um, height envelope. So we aren't quite sure if the structure is the thing that counts or if the ride vehicle during its ride cycle does count a, a part of that. So they can have technically another three or two attractions in that height envelope and we can go up to 410 feet which is super exciting um i'm not saying it's necessarily going to happen anytime soon um don't think it's happening anytime soon but i do think it would really benefit wonderland to build something like red force um at canada's wonderland i know a lot of people would really like that and it would be such a clickbait attraction for the general public and they would eat it up so if, Wonderland and Cedar Fair was brave enough building something like Red Force, somehow finding the space, uh, very difficult at Wonderland. Uh, it could really draw in a huge attendance and turn Wonderland into like that Cedar Point of Ontario and Canada where people are traveling to come ride that amazing attraction. So I definitely think that's something Wonderland and Cedar Fair should look into down the road. And I just wanted to quickly present that information to you guys because I thought it was really cool. And uh, yeah, we're going to explore some of these documents a little more and see if we can find anything else for you guys. Um, and yeah, super cool. Just wanted to pass this on. Hopefully you enjoyed the information. If you want to see other really quick videos on little tidbits about Canada's Wonderland like this, comment down below and we'll find some more information and present it to you guys as quickly as possible in short little snippets. Anyways, thanks so much for watching guys. Hope you have an amazing start to your Tuesday and you had an amazing Thanksgiving. Thanks so much for watching. Have a good one. Bye.